These are part of the latest innovations that are aimed at, among others, reducing the rising cost of domestic and institutional energy needs, but also to shield the environment against the widening destruction for fuel purposes. The effective demand for cooking fuels on a daily basis is at least 30 metric tons. But our production capacity right now is such that uh, we can only produce almost, almost more than 5%. Uh, less than 5% of what the uh, monthly demand for that cooking fuel is. So you can see that uh, the demand for cooking fuels, not just in Nache Valley, but all over Uganda, is great. The Uganda Clean Cooking Innovation Summit has drawn to a close here in Kampala with innovators, financiers, policy actors, standards agencies, and the United Nations Development Program committing to tighten onto an inclusive approach in sustainable use. According to the Ministry of Energy and Mineral Development, a new energy policy will insulate this new agenda. As stakeholders, it's very important that you have interest in this so that within the policy, we have clearly articulated how that issue will be addressed in terms of increasing awareness, creating financing mechanisms, um, Issues to do with taxation, issues to do with um, marketing, etc., etc.